Hey guys, so I'm doing the Blackfell Brides tag video. I'm basically going to be answering nine questions to do with Blackfell Brides. I came across these questions earlier, so I thought it would be fun to make a video of me answering these questions. Um, yeah, if you see me looking this way, it's because my tablet is on my table and I'm reading the questions off that. Uh, yeah, just a quick note before I start this video, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but my hair has been dyed again. You probably can't tell, it's easier to tell in person because my brown was really coming through badly and it was about time I got it dyed again, so I got it dyed again on the weekend. Um, and I think it was my fault why my brown kept coming through because I've put permanent hair dye in it and it should not be coming through as bad as it did. Um, I use a lot of heat on my hair. And I think the heat interfered with the dye and it just kept bringing out my natural colour again. And I've been stripping myself and I'm not using heat on my hair for a long time because I really want my black colour to last. Um, so hopefully that will help. So I'm just keeping my hair natural at the moment. Um, so yeah, I just thought I would add that in there. Also, I did mention in a recent haul video that I would show you the poster that I ordered. It has arrived. It's on my wall at the moment and I'll show you at the end of the video um, of what it looks like. Um, okay, so let's go on with this video. Okay, so the first question is, who's your favourite member? My favourite member is Cece, Christian Coma. He is adorable and just full of hyperness and bubbliness. And he's just really funny and sweet. And he is incredible at the drums. So, yeah, he's just my all-time favourite. I just think he's a total sweetheart. Um, favourite song? It all depends on my mood. And at the moment, it is I Am Bulletproof. Um, have you ever seen them live? Yes, you've heard me say this thousands of times. Um, basically, I saw them, God, it's going to be coming up two years in October, October 7th, which is crazy. I saw them in Birmingham on the Black Mass tour um, at the O2 Academy. It was an incredible night. Um, and if you, if you ever get the chance to see them live, I'm sorry, that was my tablet going off. If you ever get the chance to see them live, um, do it because you will not be disappointed. They always give a full 100% in all their shows and, you know, they're just incredible to see live. Um, so yeah. Yeah, my tablet nearly fell. Um, have you, have you ever met them? Uh, no. I really want to meet them. It's my dream to meet them. Um, I didn't get the VIP package at the last concert I went to and I did hear two days after the concert that I went to that they did come out around the back of the venue but I did want to wait and see if they'd come out but um, my dad was picking up me and Luke and my dad is really impatient and he just wanted to pick us up and go he didn't want to wait around so you know I had to go home um, and plus where I went to the concert in Birmingham it's really far away from where I live so I couldn't exactly find my own way home um, so yeah I had to go back to the car and be taken home, sadly. Um, have you ever been noticed by them on social media? Yes, I have. I've mainly been noticed on Twitter, but I've been noticed once on Facebook and on Instagram. Like, um, no, twice on Instagram, once on Facebook. Um, I've been noticed by CC, Jake and Ashley. I've never been noticed by Jinx or Andy, um, but I hope to one day. Um, I think Andy's going to be the hardest to get no, it's by because you know everyone wants his attention and like you know he probably gets tweeted a thousand things per minute <laughs> um you know so yeah because he's he's the lead of the band so everyone wants him to know it so yeah um i think i've got like two more questions left no no four questions left <laughs> um do you have any band merch yes i do i did a video showing you what band merch i own of um black bell bride so if you want to see that i will link it down below first merch you ever bought it was a poster back in the wall paint days um basically the poster just had andy like having his hands in a praying position and then it had the rest of the band around him with the names on it i don't have that anymore uh, luke has that at his house now um favorite album set the world on fire how did you get into them long story short i was playing a video game called saints Row three their song perfect weapon was playing like in the background of the the uh, game I really liked it, looked up Blackfell Brides, and there you go, the rest is history. <laughs> That's how my Blackfell Brides craziness, cra craziness, craziness was born. Yeah, <laughs> um, so guys, that was pretty much it for all the questions. I told you it was going to be quick. Uh, I hope that you enjoyed learning more about my Blackfell Brides craziness again. <laughs> yeah, um, okay, so quickly before I end this video, I'm going to show you the poster that I got. 
So guys, this is the poster. It just looks like that. So yeah, this is the poster that I've been hunting down forever and I finally have it and it just looks like that. It actually came really early. I was told it wasn't going to come till tomorrow, not tomorrow, Wednesday. But it actually came like the Wednesday, last Wednesday. It came last Wednesday, so it came like three days after I ordered it and I was told it would take over a week to get here, but I was surprised with a lovely poster such as that. <laughs> yeah. So guys, that is it for this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.